Alright, what's up CrossFit Boy Vancouver? Christina here with Tuesday's workout of the day. If you did Murph, my guess is your body might be feeling a little bit sore, but hey, what better way to get rid of the soreness than to move a little bit and get a sweat on? And that's exactly what we have for you today. It's not for time, the intensity is not quite as high, but I promise you after the workout you'll be feeling better than when you started. So what do we got? Four rounds, not for time, of 200 meter farmer's carry, a minute of a plank hold, a minute of dumbbell or kettlebell snatches or swings, and then a minute of flutter kicks. So how you'll do it, 200 meter farmer's carry, um, it should take about two minutes if you don't or if you're not at the track, but you can go ahead and grab whatever objects you have, whether it's dumbbells, kettlebells, buckets, cat litter, get creative. They don't have to be even on each hand. Just go ahead and switch when needed. Um, and yeah, get creative. Second part, minute of plank. Two ways you can do it, top of the push up position or on your forearms. So you can be here or here. It's up to you. If you start on the forearms and that gets challenging, see if you can go up into that high plank. Um, and hold it for the whole minute. Promise you guys you can do it. Next up, the dumbbell or kettlebell swings or snatches. So if you do a dumbbell snatch, starts on the ground, shoulders above the hips, hips above the knees, back flat, all the way up straight overhead. You can either switch it in the air or switch it at the ground. It's up to you. Um, for the kettlebell swings, you guys know the drill here, all the way up, if it's nice and light, it's a little heavier, you can go ahead and do more Russian swings, depending on how you feel it. Just move through those. Um, it's not an AMRAP, so just try to go for that whole minute, for just constant movement. Next, flutter kicks for a minute. These are always fun, and what that one will look like is on the ground, you can either have your hands by your sides or under your butt, and you're just going to be going here. If that is challenging, you can go ahead and just hold or even tuck. Um, but see if you guys can also go the entire minute without having to set your feet on the ground. Awesome. So that's the workout for today. For your warm up, just do some movement. Uh, 10 minutes of jogging, hip can, just jog slow. Burger to walk and skill transfer exercises, make sure you guys do those. And then just 10 minutes dynamic range of motion. See what might feel a little bit stiff and sore, and just kind of work that out. Maybe some arm circles, um, some burpees if you want to, some toe touches, just get nice and warm. And then, yeah, have fun on the workout, sweat a little bit, move, and yeah, have an awesome Tuesday.